places, but here at FFCC also, to stand until the Spartans score their first point. They are ready to go. Jason Weasel and Rue Hernandez, and Hernandez wins the tip. Schleeman gives it to Jason Rexlock. Spartans looking for their 10th straight win. Rexlock gets the screen, drives through traffic, backs it up, and gets the shot. So an early seat for the fans here as Rexlock uses 13 seconds to get the ball down. And the Spartans have the 2-0 advantage. Damian Green has it knocked away by Fernholz as he tried to run the pass to the high post. Now Jason Rico comes out higher. There's a nice pass inside. Good look from Rico, and he gets it to Brooks Annular. He lays it in and ties the game. We've got to travel on the Spartans on the inbounds play. Spartans turn it over. Damian Green will pass it in from underneath. Green being guarded by Chapman at the baseline. The pass goes to Hanula. Sets it out beyond the three-point arc to Gabe Amundsen. Now it's Damian Green handling the point. Back to Amundsen. He wants the three. It's in and out. And rebounded by Chapman. He went up above everybody to get that one. Starts the break. Now waits for everybody to get set as there was coverage defensively. Fernholtz, 15-footer is open. And Chris Fernholtz rattles the cage. Misses the shot. Schleeman gets it. Missed the rebound shot. Still battling for the second rebound, but Gabe Amundsen pulls it away from him. Damian Green will set it up in the offensive end. 2-2 two, two tied. It's a little over a minute gone in the opening half of this game. To the baseline, we're going to whistle in a foul. Foul was on Fernholtz, his first. Team foul number one also. Ball will be thrown in from underneath by Damian Green, the point guard. Green looking into the paint, nobody there. He delivers on a bounce to Weefer, and Weefer will put it through, and Masabi has their first lead. Four to two. Jason Retzloff met with some zone pressure, full court. The right side. Looking against Weefer in the corner, lobs it in for Hernandez, has it knocked away by Amundsen out of bounds. Weefer could not control it. Spartans will throw it in on their offensive end. 18.30 to go, first half. 4-2. Masabi with the lead, and Chapman will pass it in. Here's Schleeman in traffic, missing the shot, and losing the rebound to Jason Weefel. Damian Green up the left side, cuts to the middle against Fernholtz, drives into the lane, dishes down low. In traffic, they kick it back out. Gabe Amundsen sets for three. It's short, good offensive board underneath, and Alvin Fuller lays it back in. So Masabi with a 6-2 lead. Jason Retzloff. Again, facing some pressure up the left sideline to Chapman. Gives it back to Jason. Under 18 to play, first half. Spartans trail by four. Retzloff double team, far side steal. Dave Amundsen comes up with the basketball. Bounce pass to Damian Green. Second Spartan turnover. Green penetrating, kicking to the corner. The three is open, and Weeko nets it. Weeko's got five, and it's 9-2. Masabi running here in the beginning of this ball game. Here's Chapman, left side penetrating, dishing, and Hernandez doesn't get the roll. Loose ball comes back toward Louie, can't handle it though. So a lot of contact that was left go there. Jason Luso getting the rebound finally and putting it in Damian Green's hands. Right side of the floor, Hanula delivers the bounce pass down low. Reverse left, good and a foul, and Alvin Fuller will go to the line. He's got four points, and he'll try for number five from the free throw line. The basket counts, and the foul was on Tom Chapman, his first. Team foul number two against the Spartans, who trail 11 to 2. That's quite a fast start from Masabi. Last night, it was just the opposite. Masabi got down by 10 at Northland, never could make it up, got beat by 11. Actually trailed by as many as 20, but they have come out smoking here early in this one. Free throw is good. Three-point play for Fuller, 10-point lead now for Masabi. Bernholtz to Jason Retzlaff. Retzlaff brings it out of the backcourt. Double teamed at midcourt. Fires it down to Chapman in the corner. Tom works the dribble. Back to Jason. Shoots off the pass. Three pointer is good by Jason Retzlaff. Jason's got five. Left side. Dave Amundsen. Being pressured by Chapman. Came up with a steal but could not control it in front of the Spartan bench. Masabi will throw it in. 16.50 left, first half. Spartans trailed by 10, but after Retzloff's three, it's only a seven-point margin now at 12-5. Pass taken by Damian Green, who's guarded by Chris Fernholz. Green looks left side to Alvin Fuller. 
Sort of around the arc. Puts it in Green's hands again. Shot clock down to 12. Green lobs it inside. Nobody there. They couldn't get around Hernandez. So it's a turnover for Basabi. They're first. Spartans get the ball back. Kornholtz on the left side. Cuts to the middle. Working the dribble. Fires it to Chapman. Three-point area. Passes inside to Hernandez. Lou turns into the lane. Let's it go. Hits it. Hernandez 11 out of 15 last night from the floor. Connects on the turnaround from 12 feet. And it's 12-7 now. The Spartans trailing by five. They have scored five straight points. Dave Amundsen left side. Passing it back to Alvin Fuller at the top. Now the three by Weefel doesn't drop. Jason Rex up all alone underneath. Gets the rebound ahead for Schliemann. Beautiful pass. And the conversion at the other end on the fast break. Boy, Jason Rexoff got that rebound, looked up the court, and delivered that pass on the money to Schleeman behind the defense. 15.40 remaining, first half, 12-9, the Spartans on a seven-point run. Left side penetration and trying to pass it off, Weefer picks it up, rejected by Chapman, a foul on Chapman, not a popular call here in the Spartan gym. Chapman last night, Wound up to a three or four blocks. Lou Hernandez at four or five. Jumperlin had three. Spartans trailed 12-2 to start this one. Come back to within three at 12-9, and now Riefel will go to the free throw line. He already has five points. He will shoot two. Riefel's averaging 16 points and eight rebounds per game. He is the leader in both categories, scoring and rebounding, for Masabi. And the free throw by Weefel is off the heel, no good. As Chapman with a quick two fouls here. We have played less than five minutes. Second free throw attempt coming for Jason Weefel. Ann Williams will join us at halftime to talk about the Lady Spartans' victory. Free throw good, and it's 13-9. Spartans trail by four. Jason Retzloff passing to Fernholtz up the left side. Chapman has the ball. Delivers it to Fernholtz, over to Chapman, three-pointers open, Tom shoots it, it's off the rim, long rebound, Retzloff, free throw line, penetrating, and he is fouled on the drive. That was on number 55, Eric Schmiesing, his first, team foul number one. Chapman will throw it in from across the floor, his pass comes into Jason Retzloff. Working the dribble against Brooks Hanula. Goes behind the back on the dribble. Top of the key to Schleeman. Right side Fernholtz. The three is there. He lets it fly. It's off. And the weak side rebound is controlled by Joe Chambers. Here comes Damian Green. Right side gives to Chambers. Goes around Chapman. Up the lane against Hernandez. A charge. Spartans get the ball. And Trevor Miller is coming in. Chris Fernholtz will leave. Spartans facing some full court. 2-2-1 two -two zone pressure. 15 minutes to go in the first half. Spartans trail by four. It's 13 to nine. They have not... Well, they went two nothing, but since then, it has been all Masabi to build that lead. There's Jason Redcock right side of the lane with a nice one off the glass. Masabi scored 12 straight points to take a 12-2 lead, but then the Spartans came back with seven in a row to make it 12-9. And there's Weefel for a sneaking turnaround shot. So the margin is back to four. 15-11. The roll to Retzloff. 14 and a half minutes to play in the opening half. Retzloff to the corner to Schliemann. Schliemann takes it baseline. Let's the ball go. We've got a charge on Schliemann. Three Spartan turnovers. Schliemann has his first foul. Team foul number four already against the Spartans. 14-19 to go in this first half. 15 to 11 is the score. Spartans trailing by four. Up the right side, Brooks Hanula. Working against Wetzlaff on the wing. Hanula takes it down a little baseline. Shuffles a pass off to Green, who picks it up and misses the shot. Schmiesing had it, lost it, out of bounds off Hernandez. Masabi will throw it in on the offensive end. Tremaine Champion is checking in. Tim Schleeman will come out. And we'll see Jason Carlson, a 6'3 freshman, in for Brooks Hanula for Masabi. From underneath, Damian Green. Looks to James Carlson in the corner. Back to the top. Chambers gives it to Green. Free throw line area. Kicks it up the lane. Weefel is open for two more. He's got eight. 17-11. 
Spartans trail by six. Retzloff brings it up against Joe Chambers. Jason keeps the dribble going. Little tip, top of the key. Right side pass, Chapman goes down baseline. Now backs out, finds Champion. 12-footer by Tremaine Champion, doesn't drop. Boarded by Weeple, gives to Damian Green, and back come Masabi. Lob pass in for Chambers behind him. He pulls it down and gets the ball through anyway. Oh, yeah. Wanted to do the alley-oop on that. Timing was off, but Chambers controlled the pass and then took it up. And the lead is back at eight now for Masabi, and the Spartans turn it over. Let's lost pass over the head of Chapman. Here's Damian Green leading the offense. Carlson on the wing. Stops it with gets it back to Green. The three is open, and it's off the iron hard, and Chapman gets the board. The roll was behind the D, but Chapman didn't risk the pass that time. Here's Retzloff, the long three on the way, off the iron hard, and boarded by Schmeising. Damian Green takes it out. 12.50 remaining, first half. Now the pass is going to go back into the backcourt, and the is going to turn it over on the open back call. Norseman had their third turnover. Fernholtz back in, Gary Shepperlin in, Nick Holmquist in. Hernandez and Retzloff and Chapman will all come out. Now Weeple gets his first break. Back into the lineup, Gabe Amundsen. Spartans trail 19 to 11 with 12.47 remaining in this first half. Bernholtz right side to home twist. Back to the top to Tremaine Champion. Looks to Schumperlin, ball knocked away by Carlson as the Spartans have their fifth turnover. Right side, Green is going to be hit with a charge as he bowled Bernholtz over. And Damian Green picks up his first. And that's team foul number three against Masabi. 12.32 to go. First half action from FFCC. 19-11, Masabi by eight. Here's Fern Holtz. Working the ball in the backcourt. Cross the floor to Trevor Moreau. Moreau stops the dribble. Middle of the court to Holmquist. Then returns it to Trevor. Penetrating into the lane. Dishing. Schumper runs. And knocked away by Carlson out of bounds. Spartans will throw it in under their offensive basket. That was a nice dish by Trevor, but Schumperlin was challenged by Carlson and stripped of the ball. From underneath, the ball thrown right into the hands of Damian Green. Spartans turn it over, and up at the other end, Carlson finishes on the break, and the lead is back to 10. Sabi equals their biggest lead. Spartans have gotten back to within nine, or to within three, rather, at 12-9, but now it's back up to a 10-point lead. Schumperlin posting high at the free throw line. Fernholtz working the dribble, gets the screen, shoots off the front of the rim, and it's rebounded by Schmeising. Out in the pass, Green, up the floor to Chambers, the jam, and a 12 point lead for Masabi, and Dave Retzloff wants a timeout. Masabi by 12. Just 30, Dan. They're taking a 20-second timeout, so just go with one here, okay? GB. Spartans. Oh, Spartans uh, turned the ball over on their first possession after the timeout, and then a foul committed by Trevor Morrill as Gabe, Gabe Amundsen uh, took it to the hole. So he'll shoot two here. Amundsen has not scored. The left-hander puts it up off the heel. No good. 23-11. Masabi by 12. Their biggest lead of the ball game. Spartans led 2-0. The game was tied at 2, but once Masabi got the lead, they have not trailed. And the lead remains 12 as he misses both free throws. Jason Rexhoff. Gets the rebound and brings it over the line on the dribble. Nick Holmquist, three-point area, cuts in baseline. Nick takes it to the hole, missed the shot. And the rebound is picked up by Masabi. Here comes Damian Green. Green to the free throw line, passing out to Carlson across the floor. Amundsen has the open three, and he nets it. Gabe Amundsen with his first points of the ball game, and it is now a 15-point Masabi lead as we go into the 11-minute mark. That's off to Chris Fernholtz. Left side of the floor, now back to Jason. Straight on with a three, that's off. And boarded by Weefel. Outlet pass to Damian Green. 
Green into the front court, top of the key, stopping the dribble, looking right side to Carlson. He has the open three. That one is off. Tipped to the corner by Shumpelin, picked up by Holmes. She gives it back to Shumpelin. And now up the floor, Schoenholz into Hernandez against Schmitzing and fouled by Schmitzing. And we will go to the line looking for his first points of the ball game. Uh, correction on that. He did hit a, a field goal attempt early, so he's looking for what will be his third and fourth points of the ball game. First turn at the free throw line for Lou. Foul on Eric Schmitzing, his second. Team foul number four. Chambers is back in. Amundsen comes out. Spartans trailing 26-11 as Hernandez goes to the line. Lou had 32 last night in the Spartan victory over Vermillion. Free throw is off the heel, no good. In fact, Lou at one point hit 11 straight free throws last night. Chapman and Schleeman getting ready to come back into the lineup. Second shot by Hernandez, in and out, no good. Tipped up and in by Shumpelin. Good job by Gary Shumpelin. And it's 26-13. Here's Masabi with Damian Green back into the front court. Right side, Weefel lobs it into Chambers. Chambers passing it off. The layup doesn't drop, and it's Turnholtz controlling it down low. Marvin Fuller couldn't get it down. Turnholtz to Retzloff. Free throw line area, lets it go from there off the front of the rim. Supported by Weefel who hands it to Damian Green. Up the left side, Chambers, and he'll miss the shot but draw the foul and will shoot two. Joe Chambers, accelerating to the hole. Holmquist gets his first foul. Sixth team foul against the Spartans. Now Chapman and Schleeman are back in. Schumpel and Holmquist will come out. And here's Chambers at the foul line. He has four points. He'll try to add a couple more here. We're at the midway point of the first half. And the Spartans trail by 13. Chambers makes it 14. They have trailed by as many as 15. Well, Chambers taking his time up there. Here's the free throw. You get 10 seconds. He misses. And the rebound comes down to Schleeman. Outlet pass to Retzloff. Up the right side, Chapman. Three-point shot is open. Tom lets it fly. It's off. Good rebound by Schleeman in traffic, and he banks it in. Jim Schleeman is going to get his board. There's no doubt about that. Averaging about 10 a game. Another big one there. 27-15. Fuller. Three-point area. Giving it off now to Johnny Dinsmore, 5'9 freshman who's spelling Damian Green at the point. To the baseline, Weefel cuts in toward the lane, pulls up on the dribble, gets it back to Dinsmore, guarded by Fernholtz. Left side of the floor to Fuller. Across the floor it goes to Carlson, driving on Retzloff into the paint. Schleeman rejects the shot. Fernholtz comes up with it. Leads the break, tried to get it to Schleeman, knocked away by Dinsmore, recovered by Fuller. Eight Spartan turnovers. Last night, Spartans turned over only ten times all night. Chapman with a block. Retzloff, the outlet to Fernholtz. Here's Fernholtz, free throw line area, delivering baseline, Schleeman in traffic, can't get it to fall. Hernandez goes up and gets the rebound, is fouled. And Lou will shoot two. And Masabi has come out and played an aggressive physical game here in this first half. Foul is on Joe Chambers, his second personal, that's team foul number five. Against Masabi, Lou Hernandez 0 for 2 at the line. Well, see, he wasn't shooting. Well, Lou was not shooting, they say. Chapman will throw it in to Schleeman, who will put it in the air, and doesn't get the roll. Rolls off the rim, no good. Fuller with a defensive board and the outlet pass to Dinsmore with 8.45 to go in the first half. Johnny Dinsmore, top of the key, working against Fred Holtz. Fuller comes up high to take the pass. Now Weefel driving, dishing, Dinsmore, three-pointer. Good for Dinsmore. His first points in the ball game. Boy, Masabi is on, 30 to 15. Chapman, free throw line, penetrating into the lane. Bank shot good by Tom Chapman. His first basket. Looks like the seven, Schleeman with four. Nobody else with more than two. And there's a walk on Dinsmore. Masabi has no fifth turnover. And the Spartans will get the ball back. 30 to 17. Chapman will put it in play. To Jason Retzloff, who's picked up by Joe Chambers. 
Let's off over the line at midcourt. Super Holtz, left side, Schleeman penetrating, baseline, dishing. Retzlaff from the wing, right side of the floor. Doesn't get the drop, and it goes out of bounds on Schleeman. Jason and Chris Bernholtz both struggled in their shooting last night from the outside. Spartans had a hard time on the perimeter last night. And Jason is struggling here in, in this one also. He hit his first three. He's hit a couple of other twos, but has struggled. Dinsmore, right side, hits it. Johnny Dinsmore with five. 32 to 17, the lead is back to 15 with 7.40 to go. Flynn holds up the left side, lobs it in for Chapman, overthrows the pass, and that is turnover number nine for the Spartans. Seven and a half minutes to go. Spartans training by 15, this is the first half. Right side of the floor. Gets Handula. Handula giving it to Dinsmore now, three point arc, back to the top. Fuller's open, he'll shoot it from there and miss. Might be a little out of his range. Schleeman on the rebound, tried to get it ahead to Hernandez. It was tipped away by Fuller. Hernandez gets it back, we've got a foul, a foul on Fuller, which will be the sixth foul of the game against Musabi. No shots coming here. Starting to throw it in. Nick Holmquist checks back into the lineup. And Fernholtz will come out. 7-12 remaining. First half, Eric Schmiesing back into the lineup for Masabi, and also we'll see Gabe Amundsen checking in. Weeple will sit. Hanula will, well, he wasn't going to defend the inbounds pass. Now they drop off. And Holmquist will pass it in from in front of the Masabi bench. Gives it to Retzloff. Retzloff guarded by Dinsmore. Left side to Holmquist. High post to him. Now here's Holmquist. Looking back to Jason Retzloff. Into Schleeman, his pass right side, and Chambers goes up and steals it. That's 10 turnovers, now knocked away from behind by Schleeman and out of bounds. 6.52 remaining, first half, and it's 32 to 17. Spartans trail by 15. Spartans are averaging 90 plus points a game at 109 last night, but they've scored only 17 in the first 13 minutes. Dinsmore guarded by Holmquist. Works the dribble, passes off. To the corner it goes. Gabe Amundsen with the basketball. Bounces it out to Chambers. Top of the key, left side Dinsmore. Driving in on the wing, feeding through the lane. Good pick by Schleeman. Anticipated the pass, stepped in front of the intended receiver of the pass. And now Retzloff dumps it inside for Hernandez. He comes out and he the ball and gets through. Good But it paid off. Lou getting his third and fourth points on that field goal, and it's 32 to 19. Spartans score by 13. They need a run here at the end of the half. Amundsen trying to deliver a bounce pass inside. Now it's kicked back out to Dave Amundsen. To the top to Dinsmore. Goes around one man, and then the charge of the run into Dinsmore puts that three foul number seven against Masabi. Spartans will get the ball in the backcourt. Masabi wants a timeout. 6.02 to go, first half. Up to 30 seconds. You're listening to Spartan Basketball on KJ Oldies. Back to the action after a 20-second timeout by Masabi. The Spartans have the ball, trailing by 13 with under six minutes to go in this first half. Let's lock, working it against Hanula. Double high post now, Schleeman and Hernandez posting high at the free throw line. Schleeman now, Hernandez moves down low, gets the feed from Schleeman and gets that baseline fade away. And Lou has a half dozen. 32 to 21, Spartans down by 11 now. They have trailed by as many as 15. Damian Green to Gabe Amundsen. Crowd trying to get him going here. We've got a bump out front and a foul on Chapman and Tom has his third personal. So just some slight contact up front, and Tom gets the call. 5.32 to go, three fouls on Chapman. And to the line goes Gabe Amundsen. He has three points, hit a three-pointer. He's 0 for 2 from the line. And the lefty hits the free throw. He's got four now. 33-21. Second shot on the way, and it's good. So Amundsen gets the lead back up to 13 at 34-21. Chapman beyond the three-point arc, working the dribble, feeding through to Schleeman. We've got a foul call, but we put Schleeman on the line. And that foul is on Gabe Amundsen. It's his first. 
Team foul number eight. The main champion coming in, Tom Chapman, who has three fouls, will lead. Freeman at the line to shoot for the Spartans. He has four points. Well, is it a shooting foul or not? That's what the discussion is. Is it a shooting foul or is it a one and one? It's a one and one. Freeman will shoot the bonus. Freeman is hitting 56% of his free throws, and he hits the front end and earns the bonus. Five points for Schleeman. Spartans trail by 12, 34-22. 5.25 left, first half, second one on the way, and that's good. So Schleeman's got six, and the Spartans trail by 11 once again. Savi in the backcourt, Damian Green. Being challenged by a champion, and we got a foul on the main champion, and Damian Green is going to go to the free throw line. Champion's got his first foul. Eighth team foul against the Spartans. We're even in the foul category. Damian Green has not scored yet. Point guard who averaged, averages 12 points and seven assists per game, and he hits the free throw. So Green has his first point. And it's 35-23, second shot on the way, and that's good. 36-23, Spartans trailing by 13 once again with five minutes and 10 seconds to play in a half. McCombquist, across the floor to champion, feeding inside to Schleeman, missed the shot, draws a foul, and Schleeman will shoot two, and the foul on Weeper will be his first. Schleeman just hit two at the line a few moments ago. He has six points, as does Lou Hernandez. Jason Rexloff is seven. Chapman and Chumperlin each with two. 5.06 left, first half. Ann Williams joins us at halftime. We'll talk about the Spartans' 79-53 victory in the ladies' game. Schleeman hits. He has seven points. 6-4 freshman out of Lac La Parle Valley. Second one is in the air, and it's good. So Schleeman now with eight. 36-25, under five minutes left in this first half. Damian Green, they reverse it right side to Gabe Amundsen, bounce pass down low and all the way in, missing the shot, missing the rebound attempt, Schneesen had two good looks in tight, and the ball goes out of bounds off champion. Wasabi will throw it in from underneath. Damian Green will pass it in with 4.47 left, first half. Brooks Hanula to the corner to Gabe Amundsen, champion on him. Back to the top, they reverse it left side. Down low to the baseline, now Hanula brings it back out on the wing. Green kicks it back to Hanula. The three is on the way off the heel. Weefer with the offensive rebound on the weak side. They set it back to the top. Gun it down inside, shot blocked by Schleeman, recovered by Hernandez. Champions pass to Retzloff, it goes past him out of play. Spartans have 11 turnovers. They trail by 11 points, 36-25 with 4.21 left in the half. Wasabi into the front court, left side pass, taken by Brooks Hanula. Looks to the top, they reverse it right side to Damian Green. Now Green comes back to Gabe Amundsen. Back on the wing, they drop it inside to the low post, back upside. Amundsen to Green, penetrating, dishing, Hanula, three-pointer, in and out. And two Spartans wind up on the floor as Green came up the lane. Both Retzloff and Hernandez were down. Spartans rebound. Retzloff in the middle of Hernandez. Loose ball recovered by Masabi. And Masabi will throw it away. Coach Retzloff giving the officials an earful on that non call. Chumperlin will come in. And Tremaine Champion will come out. So it's Hernandez, Schemperlin, Holmquist, Retzloff, and Schleeman. And now Fernholz is going to come in and Holmquist will come out. Three minutes, 43 seconds left in the first half. Spartans trail, 36-25. Retzloff finds Schleeman, right side. Nice feed into Fernholz, up the lane for an easy two. Fernholz moving well without the ball. And receiving the pass in good fashion, getting it down. And the Spartans now are back to a single-digit deficit at 
3.20 to go, and the crowd trying to cheer him on for more. Schmissing will miss from the outside, and Kurt Holtz controls the board. Kurt Holtz ahead for Schleeman, and he's fouled by Schmissing. Schmissing's got his third foul. That is the 10th team foul, so it will be a two-shot situation here for, for, for uh, Schleeman. Schleeman with eight points. Alvin Fuller checks in. Three minutes, nine seconds to go. 36-27. Spartans trail by nine. And we'll see two free throws by Schleeman. Free throw is no good. Off the heel. Spartans have trailed by as many as 15. They led 2-0. Game was tied at two, and then the Saudi got the lead. They have not relinquished the lead since. Second free throw is good. So Schleeman now with nine. And we have three minutes to play. First half, and the Spartans trail by eight, 36-28. Left side, Damian Green, guarded by Fernholtz. Top of the key, Hanula. Left off on him. Right side pass to Dave Amundsen. Gets it back from Fuller to the top, Hanula. Hanula penetrating, left side of the lane. Ten on the shot clock. Here's Damian Green in the corner. Fernholtz all over him. Five on the shot clock, driving. Green will hit the baseline penetration. First field goal by Damian Green, who has four points, and the lead is 10. Cumberland back out. Schleeman to Retzloff, top of the key. Retzloff, free throw line behind the back, spinning into the lane. Let's it go. Got it down. Jason Retzloff, another good move on penetration. He's got nine. And the score is 38-30. Spartans down by eight with 2-10 to play. And the level three is good. Brooks Hanula with five points, and it's an 11-point margin. Here's Hernandez losing the ball in the lane. They start an offensive end. Here comes Masabi. They pass it inside. Fuller turning on Schleeman, missing. Schleeman gets the board. Jason Rutzloff up the right side to Fernholtz. Fernholtz will hit that three. Fernholtz with the three-pointer. Bernholtz has five points, so we'll keep it right here. Ann Williams is going to join us at halftime as the ladies' partners won their game 79-53. Dan, do we have a score on the Jaguars and the Patriots yet? We'll check in at halftime and see what, how that game is going. The winner plays the Packers in the Super Bowl. Mark Anderson's going to be happy. Larry Winger, our two station employees who are big Packer fans. Packers won big 30 to 13. Carolina stayed with them for a half. Green Bay, too much. With that 30 to 13 win. Masabi with the basketball and an eight point lead, a minute and a half remaining. First half action from FFCC. Damian Green, right side to the corner, back out. Penetration to the free throw line. The shot is short and a foul on Shumperlin. He's going to put Weeper on the line for two shots. Gary Shumperlin picks up his first foul. That's the ninth team foul against the Spartans. Free throw by Weeper is on the way and it's good. Nine points for Jason Riefel. Riefel will try to become the first Masabi Norseman in double figures with his second free throw attempt, and he does. Ten points for Riefel. 43-33, the Spartans trail by ten once again. Let's lock to Fernholtz, middle of the floor. Now Fernholtz around some contact there. Fernholtz over the line, driving, free throw line pull up, is off the heel and boarded. My Fuller of Masani. Damian Green up the middle of the floor. Green three-point arc driving into the lane. Dishing Fuller connects, but we've got a push against Fuller. And the bonus in effect. No, it's a two-shot situation, actually. Uh, the foul's on Damian Green for pushing off. His second personal, and it's a two-shot situation here because they have over ten fouls, so... Spartans will have Lou Hernandez going to the free throw line to shoot two. Lou has six points, is 0 for 2 at the line. 
Spartans trail by 10 with 57 seconds remaining. Hernandez with the shot from the line, and it's good. Blue with seven points. He had 32 last night. Hit 11 out of 15 from the floor. And 11 straight free throws at one time also. Hits both free throws here. Hernandez with eight, and the Masabi lead is eight, 43 to 35. Damian Green penetrating. Pull-up shot, baseline doesn't fall. Rebound belongs to Jason Retzloff. Spartans with 45 remaining in the half. Retzloff to Fernholtz. Spots from the left corner. Misses the shot. Everybody standing underneath, and Masabi had good rebound position. They get the board. John Stafford says, let's hold it for a last shot here. There's 25 on the shot clock, 27 on the game clock. So he doesn't want to leave the Spartans any time to score. 43-35. Spartans trail by eight. Masabi with the basketball. Damian Green. Shot clock down to 12. Green out near midcourt. Works it against Kernholz. There's Green penetrating. Spinning. Dishing off. Rufo. Top of the key. Now gives it back to Fuller. They're not going to get a shot off. No shot. 2.3 seconds remaining. And the Spartans will get an opportunity to get a shot off here. Before the end of the half. Pass comes into Rexloff. Behind the back from the court. Let's get fly. Ooh, just missed. At the buzzer as the Spartans trail by eight. Scoring recap and a summary of the first half for you. But first, let's take this two-minute timeout. You're listening to Spartan Basketball on KJJK. <clears throat> Seven three New England. Underway second half, and Damian Green dishes off to Elvin Fuller underneath. And Masabi increases her lead back up to 10. 45-35, just underway in the second half. And the rule of the game to tell you about from Algood Law Office in just a moment. Chapman from three-point range missing for the Spartans. Tom's playing with three fouls, remember. Fernholz gives the ball to Tom, Tom Chapman on the left side. Oh, he wanted to go to Fernholz again. It was an open pass for a moment, but then Riefel stepped in front of him and intercepted it. 14 Spartan turnovers. Spartans have not looked sharp today. With the basketball, Hanula. Penetrating, free throw line. Kicks it to the corner. Here's Damian Green with a shot off the glass. Loose ball near the baseline. They tie it up, and the possession arrow. Well, no, Jason... Uh, Jason Retzloff apparently... Uh, had the ball out of bounds, so the ball will belong to Masabi. Damian Green will pass it in from underneath. Spartans trailing by 10. And the ball in the possession of Masabi. The bounce pass inside, the foul, and the basket without Schleeman gets the foul. Riefel gets the basket. It's a 12-point lead, and Schleeman now has his second personal team foul number one in the uh, second half and a three-point play opportunity for Riefel. Here's the free throw. Riefel hits it. He gets the three-point play. That's five straight to start the second half. For Masabi and it's 48-35. Chapman kicking it off to Hernandez. Baseline penetration and a hoop for Lou. Double digits for Lou Hernandez. He's got 10. 48-37. Spartans trail by 11. Here's Green penetrating. Charge on Green. Damian Green with his third personal. Masabi has their ninth turnover. Lou Hernandez had the position. And now Masabi will put the pressure on. Schleeman will pass it off. 18.37 to go in the ballgame. Spartans trailing by 11. Jason Retzloff takes the inbounds pass. Retzloff behind the back on the dribble. Double team pressure in the backcourt. Stops and he's fouled. And the foul will be called on Gabe Amundsen. That's his second. 
Team foul number two against Wasabi. Spartans will throw it in from across the way. Chapman will pass the ball in. Chapman, Fernholtz, Retzloff, Schliemann, and Hernandez. The starting five starting the second half. Daniela, Green, Robinson, Rupa, and Fuller. The starting five from Wasabi starting the second half. Retzloff to Hernandez. 18 footer. Luke and hit him in the way. Who's that throw? 48-39, Spartans trail by nine. 18-10 to go in the ball game. Angela, right side, bounce pass into Weeper. Double team pressure. Ball comes loose, Weeper gets it, fires it back out. Top of the key, Damian Green feeds to Amundsen. The three is open, it's hard off the win, and Rex Lock gets the board. Jason's at five or six boards today. Nice feed into Hernandez, off the glass, 15 more. He has all six of the Spartans' second half points after Masabi scored the first five of the half. The Spartans have scored the next six. 48-41. Damian Green against Chris Kernholtz. Left side to Alvin Fuller. Fuller works the ball, top of the key to Wafo. Right side pass to Damian Green. Green bounce pass down low, fade away off the side of the rim. Hernandez skies for the rebound and passes it off to Rexlock. Spartans down by seven. Wetzlaff gets the screen, shoots from outside, and hits the three. And a timeout taken by Masabi. The Spartans with eight straight have cut the lead to five. It's 48 to 43. It's a 20-second timeout. Time for us to tell you about a rule of the game for the Hollywood Law Office of Fergus Falls. Timeout occurs, and the clock is running. Shelby stops. Wonderful timeout. When the ball is in control or at the disposal of the player of his or her team is when that can happen, or when the ball is dead. Those are the times in a game when an official will stop the clock for a timeout. And that's a rule of the game from the Hollywood Law Office of Fergus Bay. We are back to the action. The and Jeff and the got hit with one at the baseline there, and he didn't like that call. Team foul number three, turnover number 10 for Masabi. The Spartans get the ball against full court pressure, 16-50, remaining in the ball game. And the Spartans down by five. Retzloff double-teamed at midcourt, passes off to Chapman, penetrating, dishing, Hernandez up, missing at the baseline. Chapman, fade away in the line. It's a three-point call game. 48-45, Masabi, brings the ball, right side pass to Brooks Handler, sees it inside to Fuller, who is fouled, and Fuller will shoot two. Alvin Fuller going to the line, foul is on Chris Kernholtz, his second, team foul number two against the Spartans, who trail by three. They have come back strong here, Masabi scored the first five. of the second half. However, the Spartans have scored 10 in a row. And now Fuller breaks that streak. 49-45. Spartans trail by four. Fuller will try to make it a five-point lead. This free throw is good. Fuller with nine points. And Masabi leads it now by five with 16.20 to go. Jason Rexroth, left side of the floor. Against Dinsmore, went behind the back, double team pressure. Here's Flint. Oh, on the baseline, and he comes up with a big jam. There was contact with Jason Rexroth, who was scrolling as he went behind the back on the dribble and got a double team on him. But the ball went right to Chapman, who had an open baseline, and Tom made it work. Much to the delight of the crowd again, 50 to 47. Spartans down by three, and they have taken momentum here, but they still trail. Here's Moore working it against Fernholz. Right side on the wing. Dave Amundsen to the top of Fuller. And a free throw line turnaround by Weefel, and it won't drop. And the rebound goes out of bounds off the Spartans. Chapman and Fernholz collided with each other and wound up on the floor. They're okay. Asabi will pass it in. Dinsmore will put it in play. Now Schmissen is in. Chambers is in. Carlson comes back for Masabi. Fuller goes out. Hanula also leaving. Dinsmore to pass it in with 15.40 to go in the game. And the Spartans down by three. 
Dinsmore's pass comes to Carlson in the corner. Takes a couple of dribbles. Stops now, feeds Dinsmore, top of the key between the circles against Kirchner. Dinsmore stops, lobs it inside. You don't lob it over Lou. Lou Hernandez steals the ball, and Dinsmore gets it back. Dinsmore penetrating, up from eight, got it. Johnny Dinsmore with seven. 52 to 47, Spartans down by five. Let's lock. Right side to Fernholtz in the corner. This Fernholtz, bounce pass into Hernandez, hooks it up off the glass and through. Wu has eight second half points, 16 for the day. Spartans trail by three, we got a block this time on Hernandez. Wu has his first personal foul. And it's team foul number three against the Spartans. Each team now with three fouls in the second half. Five minutes gone. 52 to 49, Gary Schumperlin in for Jim Schlema. Dinsmore will pass it in under the basket on the offensive end. Johnny Dinsmore, point guard replacing Damian Green for a few minutes. Bounce pass to Schmusen, left side of the floor, back to the top. Here's Chambers against Hernandez, drives in, pulls up from 12. Lou blocks the shot, Captain gets on his foul by Schmusen, who has his fourth. Schmusen with four now. With Damian Green on the bench with three. Tom Chapman playing for the Spartans with three. And now Schmeising with four. And that's also team foul number four. Schmeising stays in the ball game, at least for the moment. Let's lock. He's got to get it over the line here. They got two seconds. Now Schumperlin lobs it to Chapman. Barely got it over. Here's Hernandez. Baseline shot open. Missed it. Schumperlin couldn't grab it. It goes out of bounds off Dinsmore. And the Spartans will work it in from underneath. 14 minutes and 37 seconds to go. Chapman throws it out to Wetzloff. Bluffs the three, takes it in, free throw line, misses off the iron, and Dinsmore comes up with the board. 14 and a half minutes remaining. Right side feed to Carlson. Looks back to Dinsmore, guarded by Fernholtz. On the wing, enters the pass down to Schmeason, goes around Hernandez, and he's got a violation as he stepped out of bounds on the baseline drive. Wasabi with their 12th turnover. Fuller is back in. Schmeesing, who has four fouls, will come out. Spartans' Gary Schumperlin has the basketball. Gives to Jason Rexloff, who will walk it up against the pressure. Lobs it across to Fernholtz. Steps over the line. Fernholtz is tripped inadvertently, but contact nonetheless. Carlson gets the foul. That's his first. Five team fouls against Masabi. Spartans are sitting with three. 14-12 remaining. 52 to 49. Masabi leading. John Chapman will pass the ball into the backcourt to Retzlaff. Against Carlson. Penetrating. Free throw line. Dishing. Hernandez in traffic. Doesn't get the drop, but does draw the foul. And Lee will shoot two. Foul is on Joe Chambers. His third, team foul number six, and here's Hernandez shooting two. Fernholtz gets a break, Trevor Moreau is in. Well, Lou has 16 points. He is two for four at the line, and he'll shoot two more here. And he hits the first one. And Nick Holmquist checking in. Tom Chapman will leave the game. 52-50, the Spartans are within two for the first time since they trailed four to two. Free throw is in the air, and it's good. 10-point half for Hernandez, 18 in the ball game, and the Spartans are down by a point. They have battled back from a 15-point deficit, and they're in a position where if they get a defensive stop here, they can take the lead for the first time since they had a 2-0. Dinsmore, driving on the roll, free throw line shot is good by Johnny Dinsmore. A three will tie it for the Spartans here. Trevor Morrell is the guy to do it. He's got it. Three-point arc off the rim and rebounded inside by Fuller. Dinsmore. For the backcourt. Dinsmore sets it left side. The three is open at the other end. Masami misses. Good offensive board position, though, and Fuller will take it out. Drives baseline around Hernandez, who blocks the shot from behind and got him with the body. Lou's got his second personal. Team foul number four. And Masabi will put Fuller on the line for two. Alvin Fuller uses that baseline pretty effectively. He has nine points. He is three for three at the line, and he will shoot two here. 13-23 to go. The Spartans trail by three. It's 54-51. to 
So we're getting ready. Gets the ball from the official. The Spartans play at International Falls against Rainy River on Friday. Ladies at 6, men at 8, and then Hibbing for the men at 1 o'clock on Saturday. We'll have that game on KJ Oldie Saturday afternoon from Hibbing. No ladies game that day because Hibbing does not have a team this year. So the Spartan ladies will play Jamestown's Junior Varsity here at FFCC Wednesday at 4 prior to the Spartan wrestling match. Second one is good, so Fuller misses the first, makes the second. He now is in double figures with 10, joining Jason Weefel, who has 13. And Masabi is up by four at 55-51. We've got a backcourt foul on Ginsmore. That's his second. That puts a bonus on. So the bonus is on early here, and Jason Rexloff will go to the line for the one and one. Jason has 11 points. Jim Schleeman is back in. Hernandez will come out. 55-51. Spartans trail by four, but Rex Lopp had a chance to cut that lead in half with a couple of free throws here. Jason, a freshman point guard, averaging 19.7 a game. And he misses the free throws. And a couple of tough ladies shooting the ball. Here's Chumpel in, and he's fouled inside. And Gary Chumpel will go to the line to shoot two. And it's Fuller. I'm sorry, it's not Fuller, it's Weefo, and that's his third. So now Schumpelin goes to the line. Here he has two points. Jason Wetzlaff last night at the free throw line finished the night 8 of 11. He was 2 for 5 at one time, but he made his last six. Now Schumpelin misses. Spartans having trouble dropping their free throws. They hit 7 out of 10 in the first half. They are 10 out of 6. So 10 out of 15. Shuffle in with three points. 55-52, a three-point margin with 13 minutes to play in the ball game. Masabi with the basketball. Fuller to Carlson. That sometimes in. There's Weefel getting it in Dinsmore's hands. He's challenged by home court. Dinsmore works a dribble. Now the roll on him. Right side pass to Weefel. Leaving all over him. Top of the key. Chambers launches the three and he nails it. Straight on. Eight points for Joe Chambers and it's a six point Masabi lead at 58 to 52. Spartans have been outscored six to one since they had cut the margin to one. Twelve and a half minutes left. Let's off. Right side gets a screen from Schumperlin. Pulls up from 15. Jason doesn't get the roll off the rim. Bodies flying all over the place. No call being made. Now Dinsmore brings it out of the backcourt from the Saudi against Marole. Passes off. Chambers wants another three. In and out this time. Schleeman had it. Lost it. Battle for it. Weefel is there and he's fouled. And Weefel will shoot two. Schleeman picks up his third personal foul. And that's team foul number five against Jim Schleeman. So Weefel is at the line. He has 13 points. He has hit four consecutive free throws. He's four out of five from the line. Chapman and Fernholz getting ready to come back in for the Spartans as Weefel gets the ball at the free throw line with his team leading by six. Weefel averages 16 points a game. He has 13 today, and there's 14. Sabi's hitting their free throws. They hit five out of six in the second half. 14 out of 19 for the game. Retzloff comes out. Fernholz goes in. Home first in. Chapman out. Shefflin comes out, and Hernandez returns. 12.06 remaining. 59-52, and now Masabi trying to kick the lead back up to eight with Weefel at the line again, and he hits it. 15 now for Jason Weefel. It is an eight-point lead for Masabi with 12 on the clock. Chapman in the front court. Driving on the wing, back out to Marul. Straight on for the three, and Trevor in and out, and a right on target. Schleeman with a rebound, knocked away from him, and no foul call there. Chambers gets the ball, Dinsmore over the corner. Weefel against Schleeman, driving on him. And he's got a five on the got his fourth foul. Well, we've had more charging calls in this game. Be interesting to see what the videotape shows on all those charges. That is a tough call to make. Now Weefel's going to come out. Gabe Amundsen will enter the ball game. 11.42 to go. 
Uh, Damian Green is still on the bench with three fouls. You got Schlesing on the bench with four. Rufo on the bench with four. Spartans have nobody with four. They've got Chapman and Schwimmer with four or three each. To the corner, Chapman steps behind the three, shoots, it's off the iron. Hernandez goes up, it's tied up. Tied up and the progression arrow is favoring who? The Spartans. And Stackpool yelling about uh, Hernandez being over the back on that rebound attempt and he may have an argument there. Here's Chapman passing it in from underneath. Turnholtz, free throw line, lets it fly, off the heel. Long rebound, Hernandez keeps it alive there. We've got the foul, and Lou will shoot two. And the foul will be called against Johnny Dinsmore, his third. And Lou Hernandez will shoot two. Lou has hit four straight from the line. He's four out of six there today. He has 18 points. And with 11-19 remaining, the Spartans lead it, are trailing by eight. They have not led it since they were ahead two to nothing. Once Masabi got the lead, they have enjoyed it throughout, including a 25-point lead at one time. Lou misses the free throw. Dinsmore comes out. Here's Damian Green back in. Damian's been sitting for about six minutes with three fouls. Second one up. That's good. So Lou has 19 now with 60 to 53 in favor of Masabi. And we have 11 minutes and 10 seconds to play in the ball game. Dave Amundsen, top of the key, stolen by Retzloff. Retzloff working, Carlson back, and Jason lays it in. 15 points for Retzloff. 60 to 55, with under 11 to play. Damian Green against Pinholz. Right side pass to Fuller to the corner to Carlson. Retzloff out on him. Carlson, bounce pass inside, knocked away by Hernandez. Scramble for the ball. Retzloff has it, they tie it up. Masabi will keep it. Masabi will throw it in on the offensive end with Brooks Hanuel replacing Carlson in the lineup. 60 to 55, the Spartans trail by five. Masabi is led by as many as 15, I think I said 25 early, 15 has been their biggest lead. Pass will come into the corner. Brooks Hanuel has it. Works the dribble outside the arc, lobs it back. To Chambers, who hands it off to Damian Green. Green is guarded by Kuhn Holtz. Right side pass to Hanula. Shot clock down to two. They're not going to get it off. Well, they do get it off. Barely. It hits the heel. There's an offensive rebound. They get the recycled 30. 35, rather. Right side of the floor. And we've got a foul called. Let's see now. The foul here is going to be called against... Tom Chapman, and that's his fourth. So now the Spartans have a player in foul trouble with four. Ten minutes and 17 seconds remaining in this ball game. 60 to 55, Masabi. Chapman's going to come out. Shumplin is in. So Tom will take the chair for a while with four fouls. So underneath, Damian Green into Gabe Amundsen in the right-hand corner. Shumplin on him. Knocks the ball away, kicks it away, actually, and that gets the referee's whistle, and they recycle the 35-second clock, and they'll throw it in underneath. Damian Green to pass it in. Turnholtz is on him. Pass comes to Hanula. Started by Retzloff. Brooks Hanula gives it back to Damian Green. Turnholtz on him. We are at the midway point of the second half. The Spartans trail by five. Top of the key, Amundsen. Left side, Chambers. Free throw line area. Off the front of the rim. Hernandez owns the board. And he passes it off to Retzloff on the left side of the floor. Jason driving inside of the lane. Stripped to the ball from behind. We've got a foul on Chambers. And Jason will shoot four. Joe so Chambers has four. Now you've got Riefel, Chambers, and Schmeising all with four. Green and Ginsmore each with three. And Jason Retzloff will shoot two. Jason has 13 points. He is 0 for 1 at the free throw line. Kevin Jason, a 6'3 sophomore, comes in. Free throw in and out, no good. Jason can't believe it. Not hitting his free throws. Second free throw opportunity for Retzloff. Good. 
Jason's got 14, and it's 60 to 56, a four-point lead for Masabi with 9.40 remaining. Steal by Rex Rock. 15th turnover for Masabi. Jason fakes the pass and finishes with the layout. So Jason Rexoff, it's a two-point ball game, nine and a half minutes to go, and Damian Green will run the show offensively. Green working the dribble. Takes it to the left side of the floor, soon holds his right hand. His front and crown has come alive, and there's a steal by Freeman. Freeman, on the break, is fouled by Fuller, and Freeman will shoot through, and Elvin Fuller picks up his second. Jim Schleeman has nine points, and he will go to the line where he has hit five out of six. Schleeman can tie this game if he can hit two free throws. Nine minutes and 13 seconds remaining. It's 60 to 58. Schleeman at the line, and the first one is good. The Spartans have once again gotten within one point. Schleeman is in double figures now with 10. The game has not been tied since it was 2-2. And it's tied at 60. Freeman with his 11th point. Spartans coming all the way back from a 15-point deficit. And the Spartan fans are on their feet. They want a defensive stop now. And a chance to get the lead. Right side, Daniela. Running by left side. Penetrating. Baseline. Double team. Back out to Fuller. Near the three-point arc. Takes it into the lane. Shoots over Schwimmen and hits it. So Fuller breaks the tie. 12 points for Fuller. Gets it off to Kernholtz. In the backcourt, Kernholtz fires it up the left side for Schleeman and Fuller. Contact to his hand and now he's got three fouls. And Schleeman will go back on the line with an opportunity if he can hit two more to tie it again. Eight minutes and 43 seconds left in regulation play. I better start saying that as close as this one is. 62 to 60. Spartans trailing by two, and Schleeman with an opportunity to tie. First free throw is up, and good. Schleeman is at eight out of nine from the line. Now for the tie at 62. Got it. 62 apiece, and Schleeman nine for 10 at the line. He's got 13 points. Damian Green, the winner's a bounce pass to Kevin Jason, and we've got a timeout taken. Parents Day at FFCC. We'll break for one minute. You're listening to Spartan Basketball on KJ. Well, the Spartan fans have come alive here, and so has the Spartan team. They have battled back from a 15-point deficit to tie this game. It's 62 apiece, and Masabi will throw it in from across the floor. The inbounds pass to the backcourt, Damian Green. Guided by Kern Holtz. Spartan ladies won earlier. Their record goes to 4-4 four four with a 79-53 win over Masabi. Erica King had 16, and probably about 8 assists to lead the ladies Spartans in that one. Remember, they play Wednesday at 4 at home against Jamestown's Junior Varsity. That does not appear on your schedule, but they will play right before the Spartan Triangular Wrestling match with the and Rochester coming in. Spartans get the rebound of that missed shot. Now the chance to take the lead. They led 2-0. That has been their only lead of this ball game. Left side pass. Schwiemann. Baseline. Shoots. Hits! Schwiemann gives the Spartans the lead at 64 to 62. Masabi with Green, bounce pass to Kevin Jason, back to the top of the key to Alvin Fuller, guarded by Hernandez, driving into the lane, and we've got a foul on Retzloff that'll put Fuller on the line. And he will shoot two. Fuller has 12 points, and he's at four of five from the free throw line. Jason has his first foul. That is the seventh team foul. Masabi has over 10, so every time the Spartans are fouled, it's a two-shot situation. Here's the free throw. On the way by Fuller. Off the wheel. No good. Spartans are up by two. Tom Chapman on the bench with four fouls. Second opportunity here from the line. 
Fuller will put it in the air and miss it again. And the rebound of Hernandez. Hernandez up the right side to Jason Retzloff. Retzloff feeding to the corner. Full Volk's baseline leaning in. It's 66-62 with 7.15 to go. Jamie and Green got it by Fernholz. Left side pass to Brooks Handler. Wanted to go to the corner. Nobody was there by the time Fuller occupied the corner. Swimming his right arm. Going to have the Kevin Jason. Back to Fuller. Three to the line area. Bounce pass. Handler lets it fly from 15. Air ball. Swimming rebound. Up the right side to Jason Oxlaw. Jason lobbing for Lou Hernandez. Fuller intercepts. Timed it perfectly. Each team now with 16 turnovers. Candela back to Fuller. He'll shoot from 15 and hit it. Nice shot by Fuller. He's got 14 at 66-64 with 6.40 to go. Jason Retzloff up the left sideline. Double teamed there. Looks back to Schumperlin. Right side turn. Holtz open from three-point range. Does not get the drop. And we've got a rebounding foul coming on Schleeman. So Schleeman will pick up his fourth foul. So now Schleeman and Chapman both have four. Trevor Morrow is going to come in. You've got Tom Chapman coming in. And going to the free throw line will be Joe Chambers. You've got a timeout taken by the Spartans. 6.27 remaining in basketball on KJ Oldies. We'll check. Get that uh, Patriot Jaguar update here, Dan. Give me that Patriot Jag of England out in front of Jacksonville in that game, but uh, hey, Patriots are a good team. Jaguars aren't done, though. I know Mark Brunel, and he's, he's running the show. Anything can happen. To the free throw line goes Joe Chambers. He has eight points, and he will shoot the one and one. He is one for two at the line, and Chambers connects. Nine points for Chambers. Second shot coming. 6.27 left. This can tie the game at 66. Chambers puts it in the air, and it is no good. Spartans get the board. Schleeman. We got Schleeman, Chapman, Retzloff, Hernandez, and Fernholz. The starting five out there for the Spartans. Carlson, Jason, Schmeesing, and Chambers and Green out there for Masani. Spartans throw it away. Chambers misses the dunk, but Carlson for the follow-up will get it down. Spartans got a little fancy there on the lob again. Green was ready for it. Stole the ball. They missed at the other end on the dunk, but the follow-up shot gives the lead back to Masabi at 67-66. The next one, Freeman off the feed from Westlaw. Freeman has had some key points here in the Spartans getting to a tie situation and then getting the lead. Now it's 68-67 Spartans. Freeman has 17 points. Left side. Chambers leaning in, missing the shot. Fernholz controls it on the defensive board and hits Retzloff up the right sideline. Retzloff, middle of the floor, three-point area. Gives to Fernholz, right side, delivers a pass inside to Hernandez, turns to the baseline, misses a shot. Schneeman tips it up off the heel, no good. And Kevin Jason comes away with it. Spartans by a point, Masabi with a basketball. 5-10 to play in the game. A steal by Chapman. Here he goes on the break, and Chapman will go up and do the two-hand slam. Coach team like this, Tom didn't have any visions of grandeur for a uh, reverse spin or anything like that. He just wanted to get it down. There's an air ball by Chambers. Retzloff in the weak side rebound. Spartans by three. Retzloff open lane. Nobody gets to Jason Retzloff. And he runs it in after Retzloff. How about Masabi? The Spartans have their biggest lead. It's 72 to 67. Well, the Spartans lead it by five with 4.40 to go. Their biggest lead of the ball game. Carlson, right side of the floor against Rex Martin. Taken by Rico, now back to Carlson. To the top to Damian Green. Green picking in Carlson's hand. 
And Green, free throw line, can't come around Rex Buck. Bucks up on the dribble, gives to Green. Stand on the shot clock. Turn Volks is on him. Here's Green, five on the shot clock. Green skips to the ball. Here's Chapman again. Chapman will go up and reverse it this time with a jam. Spartans are up by seven with four minutes to play. Chapman with two breakaway dunks in the last minute of play. Here's a steal by Sweeney. It's on me with 19 turnovers. Let's stop into the front court. Driving right side now backs up. Shows the pace. Spartans lead it by seven. 3.45 to go. Kuhnholz escapes Green's pressure. Takes it baseline. Hits the shot at the baseline and Kuhnholz in the and the Spartans are up by nine, and Tom Stackpool wants another timeout. Two minutes, 32 seconds to go. And the Spartans lead at 76 67. More basketball. You could come back here, Danny. Well, the Spartans have a nine point advantage. They have trailed by as many as 15. They really. Put on a great comeback here in the second half. For the key for three, Riefel can't hit it. Carlson, the offensive board, in traffic, missed it. Picked up by Schmusing once, twice, and finally three. Schmusing has four, it's a seven point game. Chapman over the line. Tom Chapman working the dribble, he's been in foul trouble most of the day. Hernandez at the baseline. Kicks it to the corner, Fernholtz back out to Retzlaff. We have less than three minutes to play in the game. 76-69, Spartans lead by seven. Shot clock at 15. Retzloff out near midcourt. Behind the back on the dribble, spins to the free throw line. We're gonna charge on Retzloff. Jason Retzloff gets the charge. How many charging calls have we seen today? We've seen, I think we've seen six or seven charges. Two minutes, 45 seconds to go. The Spartans lead by seven, but Damian Green has the ball in his hands to Masabi. Carlson, right side of the floor, kicks it into Schmusin, turns to the hoop and gets two more. Eric Schmusin makes it a five-point ball game, two and a half on the clock. Spartans with Jason Retzlaff. Over the line to Chapman. Looks to Schleeman on the wing. Oh, what a collision there. Full impact between Schmusin and Schleeman, and Schmusin has just fouled out of the game. Going for the ball and knocking Schleeman flat to the ground. 2.25 left, he fouls out with six points. And we'll see Polo back in. Handler comes back into the ball game. Amundsen will leave, and now Schleeman will go to the line. Schleeman has 17 points. He has hit 9 out of 10 from the free throw line. 76-71. Free throw is no good. Spartans lead it by five. Shalimun with a second opportunity. On the way and good. 18 points now for Shalimun. 77-71. Spartans by six. Masabi with the ball. Carlson looking for the screen. He dribbles out of bounds. 20. Masabi turnovers. Happened right in front of Coach Stackpool, too. Now Chapman will pass it into Jason Retzloff. Jason is guarded by Brooks Handler. Brings it up the right side of the floor. Retzloff working the dribble. Behind the back. Near side to Chapman. Now to Schleeman. Baseline penetrating. Going up to the shot. Throwing the foul. And once again, Schleeman will shoot free throws. And this time it's Jason Riefel who has picked up his fifth foul. And with 2.01 to go, he'll foul out of the game. Now Schleeman will go to the line to shoot two more. Schleeman with 18. And Tom Stackshaw will have to go to the bench again. I have a guess Joe Chambers is going to come in in his place. Chambers will be the guy. 2-0-1 remaining. 77-71. Spartans lead it by six. They have trailed by as many as 15. They have led by as many as six. Or nine, rather. Six right now. And Schleeman will shoot two. 
The shot is good. Nineteen for Schleeman. Jason Retzlaff has eighteen. Lou Hernandez has nineteen. Schleeman will stay at nineteen. Seven point lead with two minutes to play. Nice pass from Green goes to Hanula, right side of the floor, delivers it down low. Fuller penetrating against Hernandez, dishing nicely to Chambers. Hernandez did a nice job defending Fuller, but he spotted Chambers and got him the ball, and now it's 11 points for Chambers. Retzloff on his knees, picking up the ball, getting it for Lou Hernandez, and now he returns it to Jason Retzloff. A minute 35 to go, 78-73, Spartans by five. Tom Chapman with the ball against Carlson. Timeout, Spartans will break for one minute. Spartans 78, Masabi 73 with a minute 30 to go in the ball game. Spartans looking to go 10 and 0 with a victory here and they have had to overcome a 15 point deficit to get to the point where they are in this one. There are 12 seconds left on the shot clock after the Spartan timeout. Wetzloff into the lane, will hit the shot. Jason has 20 points, it's 80 to 73. Spartans by seven, one ten to go. Masabi with Puller behind the three point arc. Angela cuts into the lane. Angela all the way to the hole off the glass. No basket. He's got a charge. Ball comes into Jason Retzloff in the corner. Here's Chapman, and we've got a foul in the backcourt. Foul against Damian Green, and that is his fourth. Fifty-eight seconds remaining. Spartans lead it, eighty to seventy-three, and Chapman will go to the free throw line, and he will hit the free throw. Tom has nine points in the second half, 11 for the ball game. And he hits the second one also, and the Spartans have equaled their largest lead, 82 to 73. Here's Green, left side, passing to Chambers, into the lane. Chambers goes around Hernandez and hits the shot, and he is fouled by Hernandez. Lou took a arm in the chops. Basket is good. And Hernandez will pick up his third foul. Chambers got the field goal and drew the foul, so it's an. Did they give him the basket? I thought they gave him the basket. They didn't? Didn't give him the basket. Two shot foul. Okay, I take that back. Chambers did not get the field goal. Oh, they did get in the basket, okay. <laughs> now they'll shoot the three point. There it is. So he gets the three point throw. I thought they gave him the basket. So it's a three point play. It's a six point start in the lead. Wetzlaff out near mid court, working the ball against Dinsmore. On the dribble, double team now, passes it off to Fernholtz. Fernholtz driving, top of the key. 15 on the shot clock, pass to Hernandez, still in the way. The steal, here's Chambers, into the lane, dishing down low, Carlson will get the hoop. And a timeout taken by Masabi. Carlson has six, it's 82-78, this will take a one minute break. You're listening to Spartan Basketball on KJJK. The, uh, the table was bumped and my radio went flying, it's down underneath the bleachers, so I couldn't hear anything, so. Uh, I guess I'm on. Thanks for the magic of cellular. Dan, you just stay on the line, and I'll talk to you in a minute. On the inbounds play, the Spartans unable to handle it. As they, uh, Masabi will throw it in now. They come up with the, with the steal, and the Spartans have 20 turnovers, as do the Norsemen. Inside, Dinsmore doesn't get the drop, and he was right underneath. Right underneath, and could not get it down. Luke Hernandez is fouled. 
after grabbing the rebound. Now, Masabi has made this one very uncomfortable for the Spartans, I'll tell you. First, they led by 15, then the Spartans came back, built a nine-point lead-up with under a minute to go, but Masabi has battled back to within four, and we're sitting right there underneath the basket with a chance to get to within two. Foul was on Jason Carlson, his second, and Lou Hernandez will step to the line to shoot two, and he hits. 20 points now for Lou. Jason Retzloff also with 20. Jim Schleeman with 19. 12 for Tom Chapman. And here's number 21 for Lou Hernandez. 84-78. Penetration by Green. And it's blocked by Hernandez. Chambers, and we've got a foul called. So Chapman will foul out. He blocked the shot, but he gets the foul also. And Chambers is going to go to the line. To shoot two. So Chapman is fouled out. He'll get a good hand here. Chambers who has 14 points will go to the line. 13 seconds remaining. Spartans leading 84 to 78. And Trevor Marullo will come in to replace Tom Chapman. Spartans will play two games next weekend on the road. They go to International Falls to play Rainy River on Friday night, and then Hibbing on Saturday for a 1 o'clock game. We'll have that Hibbing game on the air on Saturday afternoon. Free throw does not block for Chambers. Spartans lead it by six. Masabi has had their chances down the stretch here. Second one by Chambers to try to make it a five-point game. They'll follow immediately on the inbounds. He hits it. There's Retzloff fouled on the far side by Damian Green, and now Green has fouled out. So Green fouls out with 11.7 on the clock. Chapman, when he fouled out, he wound up with 12 points, two out of two from the free throw line. Damian Green with four points and two out of two from the free throw line. And on the floor for the first time, Nick Sharp. Nick is the only player that has not played in this game for Masabi, and now Sharp is in the lineup. Jason Retzloff, 84-79, Spartans lead it. Jason will shoot two, and he hits. 21 for Jason. Nick Holmquist will come in. And Lou Hernandez will come out. And now one more shot for Jason. 85-79, Spartans by six. Second one up, good. Seven points, Spartan lead. 11.7 on the clock. Here comes Dinsmore out of the backcourt. Dinsmore for the top, Chambers for three. And he gets it. Chambers hits the three-pointer. And we've got a backcourt foul again that's going to put Retzloff on the line. Four seconds left in the ballgame. Foul on Brooks Hanula, his first. And Jason Retzloff back on the line. 22 points for Jason. Four seconds remaining, 86-82, Spartans by four. Retzloff will shoot two, and he hits. 14 second half points, 23 for the ball game for Jason Retzloff. Second one on the way, and that's good also. 88-82, here comes Dinsmore. Dinsmore will launch the three, and it's off the iron, no good. And the Spartans go to 10-0, but I'll tell you what, they were given a test today by Masabi. And they were able to pass that test and come up with an 88-82 victory over the Norsemen. And this is going to be quite a rematch up in Virginia when they get together later in the season. And we'll take a two-minute timeout. And when we come back, we'll recap the scoring for you and give you a summary of this afternoon's Spartan basketball doubleheader. Stay with us, you're listening to Spartan Basketball on KJJK.
Dan. 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 Danny. Hello, Dan. Dan. What do you want to know? Jason? Jason. 24. 19. 21. You bet.